All right, so this is something that I really wish I would have thought about before I started applying to colleges because I wasted so much time and money chasing a dream that I ended up not even really wanting. Like, bro, I went from hating my day-to-day -day life at school to legit getting paid money to play ping pong against Bad Baby. I'll explain the story a bit later, it's crazy. Uh, but yeah, so for the first two years of college, I actually went to film school because I thought I wanted to do something in the film industry. Like, I wanted to be creative, I wanted to write stories, I, I loved movies, so I essentially just wanted to make movies. Uh, I didn't want to be an actor or anything, but I wanted to be the guy behind the scenes. And after two years of grinding at the school, I realized that I hated it. I, I hated the people in my class. I mean, they were nice people, don't get me wrong, but like, they, they would legit watch black and white movies in French. I then talk about how incredible cinematography was in the 1960s and that the movies aren't like they used to be like bro i challenge anybody to watch a black and white movie in french without subtitles and then uh yeah get back to me if you didn't fall asleep but like this isn't even a joke this was an assignment that we had we had to watch a, a black and white french movie without subtitles and to my disbelief i was so ready to complain and like clown the assignment uh but all of my classmates were praising how great the movie was like these same people would talk about how the avengers suck and oppenheimer is overrated like bro i was so done and it wasn't even just the people that were the problem like i hated the process of movie making too my i realized that my ideas weren't creative enough so i was like okay i'll just be the numbers guy like i'll deal with project budgets or something and then I hated that even more like it was worse um, so after two long years I switched my major uh, I was put so behind on credits I started over from scratch simply because I chose a, a major like almost at random without doing adequate research of what I really wanted my end goal to be in life like I, I never practiced making movies. I didn't study any niche in the industry before I applied like special effects or lighting or whatever. I just said, hey, I like movies. That looks cool. I tried it and then I hated it. I'm making this video because I want you guys to not make the same mistake that I did. I want you to really try and think about what you want to do before you actually do it. Like if you want to study business, for example, legit, go do some business. Like uh, go mow some lawns, make a budget. Go start a website, learn how to drop ship or something. I don't know, like, even if you're making legit $100 a month, I don't care. Go do something in the field. Just get a part of it because odds are if you know nothing about the business or nothing about business in general and then just blindly jump into that major in college, you're probably going to end up hating it. You're going to wish that you were doing something else. I forget where I heard this quote, but someone once said you're either in a position of earning or a position of learning. And... That's just like the truest shit ever. Like you're, you're either making money doing what you do or you need to be learning how to do it. And I'm not here to tell you that if you switch your major, you're screwed. I, I ended up completely fine even though I switched my major. I switched to entertainment and media management with a minor in business and I ended up landing an internship somehow at Warner Music. I legit drove 40 hours to California to land this job. And that's how I ended up on the marketing team for Bad Baby for our summer. I mean, it was legit like the coolest experience ever. I remember the first time that I met her, I was so starstruck. Like this is probably the most famous person that I've ever met. And over time of seeing her after days and weeks and weeks, she just became another person to me. Like I know people say this a lot, but yeah, famous people are really just people too. They're, there's nothing special about them. Uh, so one time the team of people that I worked for went out to grab everybody lunch and my boss told me it was cool if I just stayed at the office because there weren't enough seats in the car. Uh, Bad Baby wanted to stay too, so uh, me, her, and two of her bodyguards stayed at the office and legit played ping pong for like an hour straight. I'm legit on the clock at my job getting paid to play ping pong against Bad Baby and her bodyguards. These dudes were 6'4", scary looking dudes. I mean, they were huge, but... Holy shit, they were the nicest guys ever, too. Yeah, I switched to my major. I sucked it up for a few years. I ended up in a crazy awesome position because of it. And you can do that, too. Uh, or you can take my advice, hopefully achieve your own goals years quicker than I did, and save yourself a shit ton of time and money. If you guys want to hear more about my job at Warner, I'd love to talk more about it. I think I have a couple of cool stories that I can share from my time working there. But yeah, today's video is a bit shorter than usual. 
I, I think, but if you guys like today's video, consider leaving a like or subbing to the channel. If you guys want to drop a comment or ask me a question, I try to respond to all of them. So thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.